it it looks like we have Jason Hernandez on the phone right now. Uh, Jason Hernandez of McKinney, Texas, sentenced to life in prison in 1998. He's been serving life without parole since age 21 for his role in a drug conspiracy, starting when he was only 15. One of 18, what he was one of eight prisoners whose sentences were commuted by President Obama Thursday. Welcome to Democracy Now. How do you feel, Jason? Related. I mean, it's uh, it's a dream come true, and uh, I'm just. I just hope that this is the beginning of more to come. I mean, I'm happy for what, uh, what, what was given to me by the president, but uh, it's kind of like a bittersweet moment because uh, there's other individuals in here who uh, I believe that were are more deserving than me, and uh, they just didn't they didn't believe that it, something like this could happen. But uh, now they believe, and uh, I just hope that uh, you know the president and other lawmakers you know decide to do more for other individuals in here because. Uh, you know, my mother and father this Christmas, when they come visit me and my family, my son, they're going to be crying. But uh, it's going to be tears of joy. But uh, at the same time, I'm going to have to look at other individuals, mothers and fathers and uh, kids crying in visitation, and their their cries are going to be for sorrow. So I just hope, I mean, I, I'm, I'm grateful for what the president has done, but I hope there's more to come. And, and Jason, if you could briefly uh, tell us in terms of the, the particulars of your case, how you ended up there. Uh, well, I just I started I started uh, uh, selling joints and uh, dime sacks on the corner. I mean, at, at the time in 1992 when I started selling drugs at the age of 15, it was just uh, it was the thing to do. It was it was uh, popular. I mean, uh, there was I mean in the community that I grew up in, it's kind of you, you don't see selling drugs is wrong. It's like what everybody does, and when you're a kid, you just you follow the norm and. Uh, that's what I, I grew. I mean, I make no. There's no excuse for my my, my conduct. I, I hate to say that I'm a product of my environment, but when you're a kid and you're growing up in an environment like that, I mean, that's what this. There's a good chance that that's what you're going to become. And I just. Uh, this call is from a federal prison. I just was just selling drugs. Uh, not not major amounts, but I mean, it's, it was a conspiracy under the under the terms of the law. It was a conspiracy, but it's not nothing that you would figure that you would see like on TV or nothing. A real network or, or cartel related or gang related it was just a, a bunch of group of friends that we just grew up together and uh, we sold drugs together and uh jason we just have 30 seconds where were you yesterday when you got the news uh i was in the in the warden's office i thought he was playing i, I told him are you serious can you check the uh the the, the i mean the computer because uh maybe it's a hoax or something i mean i've seen a guy some guys escape uh, a couple months back from florida and I said, man, maybe somebody is playing a game. Can you can you show me in the computer list? Can we verify this? And he says, yeah, uh, you got a you got a 20 year sentence. It's right here on the BOP website. So uh, I cried, I cried and shaked, and I'm still shaking. I mean, well, Jason, congratulations and thanks so much for joining us. Jason uh, Hernandez had his sentence commuted by President Obama yesterday. He's been serving life without parole since age 21. This is Democracy Now. I'm Amy Goodman with Juan Gonzalez. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Amy Goodman. Thanks so much for watching this report from Democracy Now!, your daily independent global grassroots news hour. We don't accept advertising or corporate funding, but rather rely on donations from viewers like you. Please make your contribution by visiting democracynow.org today. We need your support today to keep bringing you this hard-hitting, in-depth reporting.